the journey of birth to death. However, believers transfer from death to eternal life, thus they can live new life. Jesus is the man main difference our destination depends on our choice. If we believe in Jesus and live by faith, we will enjoy eternal life in the end, and we should know who Jesus is. Amen. 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 Next. Jesus is the call to God. Amen? Amen. Yes, Lord. Next. Jesus is the call to God. Jesus is very close to close to God. God and Jesus made the big picture of salvation together. And Jesus fully obeyed God's will. Thus Jesus said, He and God are one. Amen. Yes, Lord. He and God are one. However, the Pharisees and scribes crucified Jesus for blasphemy. Next. Jesus said, The Son can do nothing of His own according, but only what He sees the Father doing. For whatever the Father does, then the Son does likewise. Next yes. Okay, what about that? What do you go? Amen. That's it. It means that it, it means Jesus is equal to God. Thus, Jesus' walk is God's walk. Jesus' walk is God's walk. Nothing is hidden between the Father and the Son. Their relationship is very different from the, from the Father-Son relationship on us. God the Father gave all the authority of life and judgment to see his son Jesus. Also, God wants to receive the glory through Jesus. Jesus is equal to God. However, he fully obeyed God and opened the way to salvation. Thus, we can have eternal life when we Believe in Jesus. Amen. Next. Step. Who is Jesus? For James members, who is Jesus? Jesus is the beloved of Son of God. He is equal to God. He pretty very God. We believe in these teachers. How about us? In the Bible, the prodigal son disrespect his father by demanding his inheritance though his father was alive. Then, wasted his father's words and returned to his father as, uh, 
as of paper. Next. We should not be disobedient like the prodigal son. Next. 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 We should follow Jesus like Jesus. We also should obey God. That's how to respect Jesus. I pray all of us to obey God in 2024. Amen. 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 Next. What about that? For what to do? Amen. Yes, go. Next. Jesus has the authority of life and judgment. Amen. Amen. Through Jesus, God gave us eternal life over condemnation when we long to death. God make us have eternal life only through Jesus. Jesus accomplished God's work of salvation when we believe in Jesus we can have eternal life. Thus we can rejoice with our eternal life on us. However, those who reject Jesus cannot avoid God's judgment. That's because God and Jesus are one. Amen? Amen. God's work are Jesus' work. Next. Do you know Abraham? Abraham. Through Abraham, we can see God's authority of life. At the age, I know it's born. Sarah, Sarah. Yes, born. Nine. Nine zero. Sarah con conceived a son, though she was too old to be pregnant. At the age one hundred, Abraham had a son because he believed God's promise. Though he knew his his wives and his physical limitation. Tamapo? Yes, go. Physically, Abraham and Sarah were very old, like their people. However, God can make the impossible possible. He can revive the dead that's because Jesus has the power of eternal life. Next. One more example. Abraham offered his only son Isaac because he believed God's power of eternal life. Amen? Amen. Do you believe Jesus' power of resurrection? Amen? Amen. 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 Next. Then we will live again though we die. Eternal life belongs to Jesus. However, call Jesus Christ and expect him as their savior can experience the power of eternal life. 
Dajte ti ako... Tiesto. Tiesto. For example, I call this purpose. We should know Jesus more and more. Thus, we should listen more and read about Jesus Christ. Nigeria for yes for next if we do QT then you will learn who Jesus Christ is and how he lived. Also you will know what he achieved through his death and resurrection. Then we should believe in Jesus Christ and what he had done for us. That is our eternal life in God's kingdom. Remember, Jesus had eternal life. Thus we should thank Jesus for giving us life in 2024. Amen. 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 Next. Thank you very much for your time. Let's go. Jesus judge the world. For the people's members. Jesus is the final judge. Final judge. When Jesus comes again, all people without any exception will stand before Jesus and receive his judgment. God is only one God. Jesus Christ is God, God the Father, and the Lord did his authority of judgment to Jesus because Jesus fully obeyed God's will. Next. God is God of love and God of righteousness. With his authority, Jesus can give us eternal life and judge us. Our new life in Jesus will not end by death. In Jesus we will be resurrected and stand before Jesus. Next. Then Jesus will judge us if we believe in Jesus and doing Good deed. Jesus will reward us. Thus, one the day, one the day of Jesus' judgment, we will rejoice. However, if we do evil things, it will be the terrible day because Jesus will punish us. We are. Christian will believe in Jesus. We are saved by His grace. Thus, we have the eternal life in God's kingdom. Then, it's okay to live as you want. No, we should think about the judgment of the Jesus on the last day. 
Jesus will judge us based on our deed. Thus we should live holy and peaceful lives and please God in our lives. Amen. Yes. Baki bazaar po wo to tiringo. Lead 
our life.